inspiration behind the book of spells music was quite an easy one for us. The book itself is a 200 year old book. So we looked at the music from that era, we looked at all the you know, composers and, and styles from that period of time. And as you work your way through the book and learn more of the spells, the music begins to uh, change it. It runs through the Romantic era, becomes a little more 20th century, a little more filmic, so that by the end, uh, the music's scoring your relationship with the book. Currently we've been writing the music for the past 10 months. Originally it was just Joe working on it with the sort of defining and prototyping the system. And then Jim came on board early on in the year. What was really interesting is Jim would write some themes for the spells and then I would take them and I would integrate them into the underscore and it'd be like a basically remixing mm -hmm. um, Jim's work and it's a really interesting way to work, it's very dynamic how we take each other's content and move it around. So when it actually came to the recording, um, so we, we have all the music in the game which has been mocked up using um, sample libraries and existing sounds, so we knew everybody knew what the music was, what the notes were, um, but we wanted to put that final polish on uh, and a project like this, you just need to record it live. It does take a bit longer, it's a bit more time consuming, but we factored all that in the schedule. We knew it was going to take a little bit longer, but I think in the long term it really makes a difference, really adds the sort of polish and just makes the music such a broader experience.